And the Wisconsin State Fair is exactly one week away from opening. The massive operation now working to keep up with the changing CDC guidelines. Cassie Williams is live. Cassie, this has been tough. What can people expect? Well, if you're going to head out to the State Fair next week, if you want to go to any of the inside or indoor buildings, make sure to bring a mask. The State Fair representatives say they will continue to change policy to keep up with the CDC. John Dorinda is busy preparing for his favorite time of the year. It is Christmas. We love it. This is the Dorinda family's 67th year working State Fair Park. It was John's first job and many others. It's just working with some people, most of the people for their first job ever. It is just a delight to see those people with their first job. And of course, everything magic about State Fair. It's it's magic. There will be many other firsts this year at the fair. Canceled in 2020 due to COVID, there will be changes in 2021. We are constantly adapting, and this is a rapidly evolving situation, and it has been for several months for us, you know, coming up on 16 months for us, I believe. The park is updating its mask policy to fit the new CDC guidelines. We are following the recommendations of the CDC to wear masks indoors. We actually will provide masks for some people in case they forget them at our indoor buildings, but you have to remember, most of our buildings are outdoors or open air. At Adeline's, they will have an employee dedicated to cleaning and sanitizing high traffic areas and attention to detail something Dorinda is used to. My mother just ground it into us. She always said, if you have time to lean, you have time to clean. There will also be hundreds of hand sanitizing stations all throughout the park. Also, make sure to bring your credit card as admissions and parking this year are all cashless. Reporting live in West Dallas, Cassidy Williams, Fox 6 News. I see an opportunity next to the corn dog stand, maybe a mask vendor. All right, Cassidy, thanks.